Visual Latin 13, we cover the ablative case. I take my students every year through a book called Lingua Latina by Hans Orberg, and there's a sticky ablative question that comes up in Chapter 8. Let's set up the scene. So we have Julius. He's the father of the family, and he's giving Amelia a ring. Here's our ring magically floating in the air. And the question is, a quo Amelia annulum accipit? A quo Amelia annulum accipit? It means, from whom does Amelia accept a ring? My students are required to answer in Latin. If they can't, we put the English sentence on the board, because they typically know the English answer, and then we analyze it and diagram it and turn it into Latin. Amelia receives the ring from Julius. They may know this, but they may not know how to say this in Latin. So we analyze it together. Amelia is the subject. Always underline the subject one time. She's in the nominative case. What's she doing? She's receiving. Always underline the verb twice. She's receiving the ring. By the way, receive is an active verb because the subject is doing it. The subject is performing the action. What is the subject doing? She's receiving a ring. The ring, which is being passed around in this sentence, is the direct object. It's in the accusative case. And she's receiving the ring from. From is a preposition, which puts this in a prepositional phrase. The other side of the prepositional phrase is Julius. He's the object of the preposition. From Julius is a prepositional phrase that goes into the oblative case. The is an article adjective. Latin doesn't have any article adjectives, so we just cross those out. Now I have my students diagram this sentence so that they have a pictorial representation of the language. Amelia goes on the subject side. She's doing what? She's receiving. Amelia receives, I should have written. Amelia receives the ring. And she receives the ring from, that's the preposition, from Julius. Here's the object of the preposition. Now we translate this sentence into Latin. Amelia accipit and Amelia accipit what? Amelia accipit anilum actually I think that's just one N Amelia accipit anilum a okay so here's where the trouble begins Julius here is in the nominative case it's in the nominative case here but because of this preposition a the next word is going into the ablative case, as we already established here. So we're going to change the U.S. to O. Amelia accipit anilum a juli o. This is still slightly bad Latin word order. So at the end of it all, we'll flip it and put it into better Latin word order. So Amelia anilum accipit will move to the end. Amelia anilum a julio chip it. So there you go. We now have this sentence translated into Latin and we've got Julius in the ablative case. If you like this uh, tutorial and you enjoy bad handwriting, then by all means subscribe and learn more. I'll see you next time.